vegetable. Hello there, and welcome to episode 88 of my series where I try to play the cities, towns, and urban areas of Norway perfectly on GeoGuessr. That is, to play uh, games of 25,000 points for each location. Today we have made it to the Stavanger district of Hundvog, Dogs Bay. Uh, originally I had not planned to play Stavanger district by district. I uh, decided I would only do that for Os Oslo, Bergen and Trondheim. But then I figured Stavanger is also sort of large enough to to um, to, to, and to um, what's the word? Deserve that kind of treatment. So I uh, redecided and have now made maps of all the districts of Stavanger. Now Hundvog is uh, sort of a well, it's both very old and sort of recent. Sort of recent. And the uh, there are traces of uh, of people living here that are like like nine and a half thousand years old. And uh, today it serves both as uh, we got the Rosenberg shipyard here. So there's, there's a fair bit of industry in the southern bits here, and then most of the rest of it is quite residential. Um, and, uh, well, it's not a very tall island, it's like 31 meters above sea level at Bui, and uh, 35 meters above sea level on the Hundvog Island itself. There's 12,500 12 people living here, and uh, it's tied to the rest of Stavanger with the city bridge gone on, uh, across these tiny islands here. So, yeah, uh, I don't really know much about Hundvog. I've never been to this part of Stavanger. Well, I've hardly been to Stavanger at all. So, this will be pretty new to me. So, let's go. Okay, let's see what we find in Hundvog in Stavanger. Let's start a game, even. And let's have a look. Oh, as I expected, fairly uh, residential. That is the Rosenberg shipyard. So we are. We must be somewhere over here. The one, yeah, I guess the shipyard extends down here as well. So, yeah. So probably somewhere over here. Well, not probably where we are. And yeah, there's a lot of boat houses extending into the sea here. So. Okay, first we figure out which street this is. Well, it's obvious, I guess, that it is the Ulnes Road. Or Ulsnes Road. It would be really weird if it wasn't. Mm, okay, but... Uh, okay. No, it's near the Vorgen, actually. Wow. Yeah, and we're on the other side of the, on the main road. On the, on the opposite side of the main road from what I thought. So actually we're looking at the shipyard like over like so. Right. Now this could be a little challenging finding the exact location of. Um, can I find that thing? Let's look for that first. Now there's a bend here, and that's probably that one. This house is likely to be that one. Then we've got this house must be that one. And we're looking down here. Yes, we are. So we're standing here. Let's go with that. Yes. 
I'm glad I was right about that one. <laughs> uh, next. And we're off to another place in Hundborg. I think the entire playthrough will look pretty much like this unless we are placed smack in the middle of the shipyard. Okay, no names. We're looking west. This must be on one of these islands. There's a pier extending into the water. So... That looks like a reasonable candidate, doesn't it? We could well have... Let's see, I'm looking northeast. But there's a bend in the hill here, so that's not right. Looking northeast. We could be here. That actually looks more like it because there's this bend on the hill here. And I bet if I follow this around, I might find myself wrong. Uh, no, actually, we're probably here right now. Right, okay. I'm gonna say that we were over there. And let's see just how far up the hill are we? So we're somewhere here. Okay, now we are actually just before. We are sort of here. Yeah, I'll go with that. Good. Okay, so that's the bridge across from the city. There's a marina. And let's see, I think I think we're looking across to Grasholmen, the grassy the grass island. And let's see a ship shape. Yes. Boat repairs and service. So we are here. We should be. New development. Yeah, that looks good. I have no idea who Cat and Card and A Summers Summer was, but uh Definitely someone, lo someone local. This road, okay. It's called Smallevayan, the narrow road, or the, uh, it could well be. That is likely to be the main road. And. Uh, That might be part of the shipyard. There's the bridge across to the city. So we could well be somewhere over here. Mm. But... Hmm. So I'm looking at the bridge from the southeast towards the southeast. And I'm a little bit confused right now. So oh here we go. Here's here we go. The narrow road is here and we're standing Looking at that, that's an interesting little bit of architecture. Uh, it should be about here. Turn around, have a look. Yeah. There. Bullseye. And now we go on to the final round already. And... 
Yeah, it has the other bridge. Oh, oh. <laughs> well, that's disappointing. <laughs> uh, 200 odd locations, and we get the same one. That's. Um... Yeah, that's not quite what we bargained for, is it? So uh, we find ourselves there. So that is Hundvold played to perfection, but seven minutes. Now we'll, we'll 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 do one more round. Come on. Let's see. Oh, uh, I might come to regret that. <laughs> okay, so now we're right above the location we were at. We're actually we're actually up here. And. Uh, Hmm. <laughs> Let's see. It was sort of smack right on top of this. All this straight here. And can we find anything? Well, is this? No, of course it's not. Uh, <laughs> well, we have perfected this anyway. So. I'm just going to take a huge punt and say that we are there. Oh, that wasn't even a massive miss. Okay, um, back in the residential areas, probably says on the billboard here what this one is called. Hunvog Ring 1. Okay. <laughs> uh, okay, so it's Hunvog Ring. Uh, <laughs> but which area here is called Hunvogering 1 is a complete mystery to me. So... This is right now in there. And there's a main road going down here. And that's Ulabrand's road. Okay, so Ulabrand was... Uh, a little confused to why they got him here. He was sort of a legendary harbor pilot, I believe. But that was in the area around in the area around uh, Sunderfjord on the Oslofjord. Let's see. So where is Ulabrands Road? Now we're looking south. That's true. Let's see. Oh! So Ulabrans Road, now we're looking north from the Ring Road. So how did I miss... So Eustbe, that is, uh, that was an old... site of an old farm where they found traces of settlement that are like nine and a half thousand years old. Well, this has me well confused right now. Okay. That's a school. Shay is school. That ought to be possible to find, right? Shayerindo. Okay. Then Shayer School should be nearby. Shayhagen. Where is this? Here's the school. Ah, yes, I was, I was suspecting that. Then so they've given it a name. Here is that. Right. So we've got Ula Bran. So Teddy Vegan is the eponymous hero of a an epic poem by Norwegian playwright Ibsen. And uh, he came from Grimstad, or at least around Grimstad, which hasn't featured yet, but will later on in the series. Mm -hmm. So we are. Oh yeah, where are we? Are we here? Yes, we are. Uh huh. So we are there, much. 
and to the next one. Oh, that's a lovely little location. So this must be on one of those, must be on one of these islands. And what's the name of that road? Björnøyhavna. Bear Island Harbour. So we are here. And uh, actually, that should put us looking at that house. Middle of it, so we should be there. Shouldn't we? Perpendicular to the road. Ooh. Oh, wait a minute, there's a, sl a slight misalignment here as well. So. Uh, hmm. Well, I think we'll go with that. Close enough. And then a roundabout. Ulsnes. There's the shipyard directly to the south. So I assume we are up there somewhere at the Muscles Road and uh, yeah, the Razor Shell Road and uh, the Oyster Road. So let's see. Southeast. No, we're not here because there is no road to the southeast. <laughs> How about here then? Um, northwest. Is there an SO here? Real good job of confusing myself again. Wait a minute, is that the church? That is the church. Let's see. This who's about no, who's about chapel? But where's the church? I should know because I recently made a map of churches and chapels in Norway, um, which is a brilliant map, by the way. You should really play that. Um, but. <laughs> Uh, oh, here we are. Here we are. That's the SO. And we are... I've also made a map called Roundabouts of Norway, or, or around, uh, Round and About with Roundabouts or something like that in Norway. That's also a fun map to play. Uh, what should be about there? There we go. And the final round. Interesting. Is this? No, it's not the same roundabout. Who's up there? I've got a Kiwi. Um, let's see. There aren't that many roundabouts. So let's see. Who's up there? No, should we hit? No. Hmm. Okay, so what's this road called then? Lundabucken. So it's Husebe Hagen, not the Husebe Road, Husebe Orchid. So why isn't the Husebe Road here? Husebe Road, I mean. Hmm. I'm impressed by the ability of this tiny map to thoroughly confuse me. Vinvogering East. Okay, let's find the Kiwi. Here's the Kiwi. And what's the roundabout then? No, that's, a ki no, that's not the Kiwi. That's the Kiwi. That's the Kiwi. Um, Here's Lundbakken. That's that road. 
Right, so we are down here. Whew. And perpendicular, we're looking at this school here. And that... Uh, I might find myself being off here, but we'll go with that. Nice. So yeah, that is two rounds of Hundvog for you all. And that was a pleasant little stroll through the Stavanger suburb. Or rather, the Stavanger district. So yeah, that is episode... Uh, was it? What is it now? 89, I think? Well, uh, no. Episode 88 in the back. Please take in tomorrow for episode 89. Until then, bye-bye.